Hello and welcome to Minikun Tutorials. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to fix blur screen, blur text, blur fonts, or even blur apps problems in your Windows PC. Okay, so this is very common in Windows 11, and I never knew this problem existed until I my PC. Uh, broke down and then I had to change my PC. So when I got my new PC, uh, the PC came directly with Windows 11. Okay. So when I started to use a PC, it was just running very nicely and everything was just good, you know. It's, um, a, I mean, a very new 11th generation PC with, um, you know, very, very good, uh, perform for performance you know but i just noticed that the image quality was quite poor and then text wasn't also very clear and um you know when i'm playing a video online i would notice some kind of some pixels or whatever they call them shiny style so though the video would be a full hd video you know the screen is actually um what do you call it full hd screen resolution so i was expecting the best of everything but i noticed that text wasn't very clear and all of that so i was a little bit troubled and i decided to search everywhere and i uh, finally got some answers and this worked perfectly well for me once i did that as you can see on my screen even looking at the apps these are the apps uh the, the, the everything is just clear okay if i should anything at all now if i'm to open an image uh, or if i'm watching a video whatever i just enjoy the cleanliness of the pc now after having followed all these steps so i'm going to share with you how you can also fix this problem all right so the first thing that we can do is to set the screen resolution and to do this you simply have to click on the windows button here and then you would see uh settings right here okay else you could also search here just tap here and then search so you search settings and it's also here so just double click on settings and then when you come to settings uh make sure you click on system and then you come and click on your display settings okay so you click on display once you click on display, you have to make sure that the scale here, okay, the scale is, uh, you come to actually scale and layout, okay? So you have to make sure that the, what do you call it? The scale is actually in the recommended mode, okay? Okay, so the recommended uh, settings is 125%. So you can click on this drop down menu and make sure that you've selected 125 recommended. Okay. And then you also make sure that the display resolution is also adjusted to what? Uh, the recommended uh, resolution. So make sure you click here. Sorry. You see, I mistakenly pressed on something. So you would notice that once i selected something else the screen started becoming blur so you have to make sure the right resolution is selected so make sure that you select what the recommended resolution let me just let's just play with it okay let's assume i pick a wrong resolution so if i should pick for instance uh this resolution here 1680 times whatever if i should pick this Notice that the, sc the screen has become very blur now. I could either keep the change, keep the changes, or revert it. So I don't need this. So I just simply revert it. So I, you have to make sure that you select recommended. If it wasn't recommended, make sure it's not recommended. Make sure the scale two is on recommended. Okay, and then you keep the changes afterwards. After doing this, you could restart your PC to see whether this is going to fix the problem. But in most cases, your your screen resolution will always be on recommended. I'm not saying all the times, but in most cases, it will always be on recommended mode and 
that wouldn't be the problem. But in your in the case where your screen resolution was messed up and then you, you have to just set it to recommended, display the scale and then the resolution, display resolution, and then restart your PC and see whether this works for you. So let's move to the next step. The next step has to do with um, editing your clear type data text, okay? So you will have to adjust your clear type text. And how do we do that? So let me close this uh, window here. To do this, to edit your clear type data text, all that you have to do is to come to the search menu here and then come and uh, write adjust. Sorry, adjust. Okay, it's right here. Adjust. Um, just write adjust uh, clear type text. Okay, so you, you double click on it. And then, <clears throat> sorry, sorry for that. Now, once it opens, you simply click on next. Make sure you check this particular box. Turn on uh, clear type. Make sure it's checked. And then you click on next. Now, when you click on next, they would ask you Windows is making sure your monitor is set to its, sorry, to its native resolution, blah, blah, blah. Just click on next. Your monitor display is set to its native resolution. Still click on next. And now, once you click on next, you'll have to follow the, um, I mean, the steps in this particular window, okay? display dialog box okay just follow the steps in this particular dialog box so you at each step you would have to select the or click on the text sample that looks the best to you okay that is the, the, the clearest that is most the, i don't know how to even describe it okay the clean the most clean text okay for instance by comparing these two text boxes you would realize that this one is very blur. The second one is very blur, whereas the first one is very clean and clear, right? So you make sure you select the, the first one and then you click on next. And now over here, you have, um, you know, to also choose again. So among all these examples, I feel like this, this second one is the brightest. Or, you know, but you could pick the first one too, it's very clean. So it's quite complicated to choose. But let's go with the second one. Then you click on next. Among uh, all these three is the first one that is very clean. So I'll pick that one, then I click on next. So once you finish doing this, this will help improve the text quality on your PC. So you will no longer see those uh, blurred text and those kind of stuff, it will disappear. So this one to you pick the second one, or you could pick any one that of your choice. And then if I should click on next, or maybe this one looks brighter, I'm not sure. This is bold, but this one looks uh, brighter in my opinion. You know? So just pick whatever that is okay for you. You could keep this. This is clean. If you want something bold, then you have to pick one of these. But I just want clean and, uh, or even this one is also very, I think this is better in my opinion. So I'll pick this one. The other ones are too bold. So let me pick this one. Then I'll click on next. And then just click on finish. So once I do this, my uh, text quality will improve. Okay. And now, after doing this, please kindly restart your PC to make sure that uh, the effects are applied so that your PC, the text will start to look brighter. Now, the third settings that we could do is to use performance settings okay so to do this simply come to your search menu again and come and write uh, view advanced system settings so write view sorry view 
see view advanced system settings it's right here so you simply click on this and then when you come here come and click on advanced i'm coming so come and click on advanced and then you click on the performance settings here so once you click on the performance settings make sure that the visual effects is actually on adjust for best performance so by default if you haven't already done these settings when you come it will be on rather uh let windows choose what's best for your pc you could also be on any other thing maybe adjust to best performance or whatever you know but what you have to do is to say is to choose adjust to adjust for best appearance okay so once you select adjust for best appearance then you go ahead and hit apply so when you click on apply then you click on okay and then also click on okay now after each step make sure you restart your pc for the effects to be applied now the last thing that we would look at is maybe updating uh graphics for i mean up, upgrade uh, sorry i said update the last thing that we have to look at is updating the graphics driver okay so to do this simply come and to update your graphics driver simply come to the search menu here and come and search device manager so double click on device manager and then when you come over here come and look for um comment scroll down let's see display adapters okay come and click on display adapters and then over here you have your uh what do you call it your graphics driver here okay so what you would have to do is that simply right click on the graphics driver and then select update driver now when you select update driver click on search for automatically for drivers and then click on search for updated drivers on windows update okay so currently as you can see i followed this step and i updated my windows drivers so they are saying i'm up to date i don't have any available updates else you could click on check for updates okay so fortunately for me i'm up to date i don't have any updates and after if ever there are some updates for you to install you make sure you install these updates and then after installation make sure you restart your pc